Friends, the market has been showing great growth in recent days, and the number of positive news and opportunities to make money has grown tenfold. That's why today I want to make a video continuation of my previous selection, because that portfolio has only five tokens. So today, we're going to talk about five more highly interesting coins that can bring you closer to millionaire status in this bull market. Additionally, we will talk about what can create a temporary price drop. Be sure to watch this video to the end, as each and every part of it will be of maximum benefit to you. Subscribe and like it. Three, two, one, fire! You all know about this crypto exchange. They are paying off their creditors in the amount of 196,000 BTC. Recently, they started the process of transferring the first parts of the debt, then afterwards, the market showed a drop and incredible strength at the same time. Here is the most visual demonstration of this event. On July 16th, we saw a good drop from 64,000 on Bitcoin to 62, and then immediately after the opening of the US trading session, absolutely all the drop was bought back. Even more, the price surged to $65,000. Today, while making the video, an identical test transfer was made from the exchange wallet. So it is likely that we will see a very similar scenario, a test transfer, a large transfer, followed by a market drop and then another rise. So I don't recommend you to worry too much about it. One way or another, we are going to have fun times in crypto where absolutely everyone will be able to make money. I still believe that AI will be one of the two, three main narratives in this market, so I can't help but increase the share of such coins in my portfolio. I have already added ICP and Render, but today I would like to add some other coins. I will start with Akash, many of you have written to me about it. In fact, I haven't done any content on this asset for quite some time, although it is definitely worth it. Akash is a prominent representative of GPU AI, which has a fairly large marketplace for renting and leasing computing power. In general, the GPU industry looks very promising, as top experts believe that it will have a capitalization of $275 billion by 2029. For example, NVIDIA earned more than $10 billion in the first quarter of 2024 from its computing GPUs for data centers, and Elon Musk is building huge GPU installations. In general, Akash is almost a direct competitor to Render Network, but with much more advanced functionality, in fact, it is a marketplace where you can rent a GPU, and it is quite cheap. And the main difference is, is that Render is more focused on working with large companies and corporations. However, Akash offers unique conditions that no big company can compete with. This is actually not just my words, it is actually confirmed in the form of profit, which grew by 20% in the first half of 2024. So, given all this data and the technology behind this project, I see the potential for growth at least to the price point of Render Network. The second token is TAO, which I don't talk about very often either, but it's really, really interesting. In fact, I have always looked at this asset with interest because the project has a very useful and necessary utility, but the token was overvalued enough to almost always invest in it. Now the asset is looking more attractive, Bittensore is creating a decentralized platform where digital resources such as computing power, data, and AI models can be exchanged directly between users without intermediaries. They have already created a trading bot based on their data, which I talked about in my videos. By the way, it has finally started trading again, probably just waiting for the market to revive. Given the importance of a so-called combiner, I think it has every chance of not only returning to its recent all-time highs, but going much higher this time. Let me know, what do you think about these AI projects? The Ethereum ecosystem is the largest structure in crypto, and right now, in my opinion, it is close to its peak. After all, tomorrow's spot Ethereum ETFs will finally be fully accepted. Tens of thousands of interesting coins and projects are released every day, and Ethereum itself has the massive support of the entire community. So of course you should have the main ecosystem token in your portfolio, but today I want to add even riskier assets. So the first asset in the selection is ENS, Ethereum Name Service. I have talked about this project many times and we have seen a lot of growth since the first mention. However, I see even greater opportunities for the asset's growth. 
By the way, if you don't want to miss more tokens that have shown good growth, I recommend subscribing to the channel. After all, the project has a lot of support from the founder of the Ethereum blockchain, who openly says that ENS has a useful utility and is one of the most successful nonprofit projects in the entire market. I believe that in the future, the trend and the need to have your own Ethereum domain will become almost mandatory, so the popularity of the project and its utility will increase many times over. Therefore, if we talk about the potential, it seems to me that ENS will make at least 3x in the near future, and at the peak of the bull market, it is quite possible to see even more price points. And now, from something technological and necessary for the market, I propose to move on to a rather risky asset. However, before we do, I must point out that memecoins are highly volatile and risky assets, so you need to treat them with caution and restraint. Understanding the real risks, I believe that during this bull market, the meme coin trend will bring the biggest and easiest Xs, but at the same time the easiest wrecks in just a few minutes. So it's very important to choose really worthwhile mem coins and avoid making silly mistakes. Here's a great anti-example. A trader decided to invest about $8 million in Bowdoin token. As you can understand, this is a political token dedicated to the current U.S. president. He invested these funds at the peak of the asset's price and recently sold it for only $85,000, which means that he sold it when it became known that the token had no chance. So his case is a great example for us. We need to choose really proper assets even among memes. That's why I decided to add Pepe, who proves to be a great asset whenever there is positive news for Ethereum. I don't want to talk about this asset for a long time because it's better to understand it yourself. It has virtually no value for the market, which is its main advantage. Currently, the leader of memcoins on Ethereum is Shiba Inu, and this token has already gone through several cycles. I think that in this bull cycle, given the arrival of a new large audience from Web2, the introduction of Ethereum ETFs and the influx of new liquidity, we will see a change in the narrative. A new memcoin leader is likely to emerge, but you should keep in mind the risks, because there are a lot of them in this area of crypto. Let us know in the comments what you think. Will Pepe be able to take the throne of the biggest meme on this blockchain? I believe that GameFi is the best way to bring a new audience to crypto. However, to do this we need AAA projects, which unfortunately the crypto market has not yet produced. It seems to me that it is only a matter of time, so we should immediately choose the project that has a better chance of creating something like this. Beam Network is promoting a similar idea by creating an ecosystem for developing Web3 games using a special Beam SDK engine. Just as Cosmos is creating a global platform for blockchain launches, Beam is focusing on crypto games, which is a relevant narrative in the current cycle. With the influx of a new audience and collaboration with well-known game studios and developers, I see great potential for the price of Beamcoin to grow, achieving a maximum capitalization similar to Gala in the GameFi space is the immediate goal for Beam Network. And at the top of the bull market, I can believe in 10x. And I want to remind you that this video is by no means financial advice. This is just my vision and thoughts on the market, so you should always do your own research before investing and invest wisely. Please like the video if you enjoyed it. Subscribe to the channel so you don't miss the growth of coins. Thanks for watching, your coin post.